What's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Streamer Life Simulator. Today is finally the day we are moving out of this dump. I don't want to live here anymore. It's gross. It's dusty all the time. It's it's nasty looking inside here. They never did say how much the initial house actually costs, but I can't imagine that it costs very much. This whole area that we live in is just absolute crap. So thankfully, our first move here is from this crappy house to downtown to that apartment building that we checked out we haven't actually been inside that building just yet we went uh we went in the stairwell we weren't able to enter in the apartment room right don't you have like a room number i suppose it depends on the apartment complex doesn't it as you can tell i've never lived in an apartment <laughs> but we're gonna we're gonna do that today we're gonna break that tradition today so uh, first things first. Oh, I forgot a, I forgot our bed, dude. I forgot our bed. Okay, so let's take our bed quickly. Oh, we, we probably got to put it in our inventory. Um, we're going to sell this. Oh, he's not going to even want it because we're too dirty. We're going to sell our old bed instead of just leaving it by the dumpster. We're going to sell it to the retired marine dude that lives in our neighborhood. That also... God... <laughs> It's a good thing we're moving. It's a good thing we're moving. You know what? I'm tired of accidentally picking it. <laughs> uh, as I was saying, I'm tired of accidentally picking up our things when we're trying to use them or interact with them. Now that we're all freshened up, let's quickly open up this thingy-ma-bob-ma-doo-hicker. We got a bill to pay real quick. $234. So now that we have so many of these uh, Bitcoin miners in here, our electricity bill is just going to keep skyrocketing. And uh, of course, we're just going to keep buying more of those so we can in turn get more Bitcoin. That bill is going to be pretty high by the end of things, I'm sure. So next, the real estate application. No, we're not no, we need food first. Or should we get a new house and then order food? What are our stats at right now? We need food now. <laughs> okay, we need food right now. Additionally, the nice part about moving to the apartment complex is that theoretically, I don't know this for a fact, but theoretically we should be able to purchase a better internet plan or internet package, which should give us better speeds and then we'll be able to have a higher bit rate on our stream. We should probably get a face cam or a webcam as well so we can, you know, interact with our audience a little bit better. I think that would be a good thing to do. What did I want to do next? Real estate. Right. We need to buy that apartment. So we have around $8,000, I think. Oh, we did have $8,000. We have $7,900 right now. So we should still be able to afford it. I think it was like $6,000. Is that where we live now in this one? No, this is a different thing entirely. A detached hut. Great place by the lake away from the noise of the city. $4,600. Or we could go right into the city for $6,200 in that apartment. There's also another house for $1,200. I'm sorry, $12,000. And then one for $17,000. So yeah, we're definitely going the apartment route. So maximum internet package here is going to be 50 down, 10 up, which is way better than what we have right now. M275, don't know what that means. Maximum internet package is 2 plus 1. Don't know what that means. Building age. Okay, that that makes sense. Oh, it's square square meters instead of square feet. That's what that is. Okay, so 75 square meters. It looks like we have a kitchen, which is cool. Got a closet. Got a nice view of downtown. Some cool, uh, what is that, kanji? Nice. I'm into it. $6,200. Let's go ahead and buy it. Boom. There we go. There's no... <laughs> There's no, like, pop-up. Our, uh, our account just depletes. So I guess that's the only way we know we bought the place. Good deal. So today's moving day, ladies and gentlemen. I'm, uh, I'm not sure what else we're going to be able to accomplish in this time frame. But the good news is we have a new apartment. We're going to be escaping this horrible neighborhood that we've lived in now for way too long. Way longer than we should have. I really wanted to buy a car, but a lot of you were like, mm, maybe you should move to an apartment. And at the end of the day, I think that's probably the better idea. All right, $62 for our old bed. I'm not even going to try to bargain with him. Moving's going to kind of suck because we have five Bitcoin miners. We only have five inventory slots in our backpack. We also have an additional, I think, four in our car. So we really can't fit all that much 
I think we should probably sell this old wood table and that plastic chair if we're going to kind of keep the stuff we have here. So let's let's do that as well. Make sure we put this stuff in our inventory. Okay, what's going on? Sell the wooden table, sell the plastic chair. What else can we sell that we don't really want to take with us? Maybe the shelf. We have no real need for the shelf. One less thing to uh, transfer over to the new apartment. And then I'm going to keep that poster since that's our only one. Everything else should be okay. I'm hoping, fingers crossed, we can do this move in like two trips. Hopefully the first trip, you know, we'll take the essentials. Second trip out. We'll kind of take all the additional things. So let's see. Oh, you smell disgusting. Fantastic. I don't know why I smell disgusting because I quite literally just showered. But uh, let's go shower again and then we'll go talk to dude, bro. There we go. Okay, hygiene looking much better. Oh, is it because we're cold? 28. There we go. You should do your toilet. Oh, yeah, I should. Dude, what happened? What happened to our stats? Oh, right. We ate a bunch of ramen. That's what happened. Hey there, brother. I'm gonna see if you can buy some of this stuff off me. I Turns out I don't actually need any of it. So, trying to find a good home for it all. 229 bucks, dude. Nicely done. All right, we've made some serious Skrilla already this episode. I'm pretty happy with that. Also, mush mouth today for whatever reason. I just, I, I can't form full sentences and can hardly speak. But uh, we're going to keep pressing on. There's videos to be made, both in-game and IRL. All right, what else we got? What else we got? What else can we move right now? We're going to probably want our bed. Let's start by moving. No, actually, let's keep all the miners because the longer they're up, the more money we're going to be making. Let's go ahead and move our computer stuff first. That seems like a good idea. So let's grab our computer. We'll put that in our inventory. I can't do this without disassembling the computer. Really? I'm going to have to take each component out of this thing and put it in my car. Or can I just put the whole thing in the car's trunk? I can't do this without disassembling the computer, dude. That sucks. That actually sucks a lot. And we can't even do that in here. We have to do it in the house. Okay. It's going to take a lot more trips than I initially thought then in that case. All right. So let's grab all of this stuff out of here then. All these components. Yeah, dude, this right here is one trip alone. Can't carry any more items. You can in your hands though, boy. You can in your hands. All right. Let's pop the trunk. Oh, dude, when did we get so many more spaces in our car trunk? Has that always been that way? 12 whole slots in here, dude. That is freaking crazy. Okay, so maybe we're in the clear. It's it's pretty up in the air, as you guys can tell. I'm not really sure how long this is going to take, how many trips we have to make. All right, how much more room do we have? We got two more slots so we can get the chair as well as the desk. I wonder how many slots the van can hold at the, the car dealership. There was a van for sale, like a, a van for sale. There was a van for sale at the car dealership for, I think, 12000 or something along those lines. Perfect. Everything fits in there nicely. Okay, so car is full. But I wonder how many slots the trunk on the van has. All right, let's grab our poster off the wall. Grab our bathtub. Definitely going to want that. Grab our toilet next. We're going to be able to make one initial trip with all of our main, you know, household items. Everything except for these five Bitcoin miners. But again, that's honestly a good thing because the longer they're up, the more money we're going to be making. Man, I am going to miss this place. I am going to miss this place just because of how bizarre the neighborhood is. But nonetheless, let's go ahead and hop in our rust bucket of a car here and we will head out. Dude, let's hide those tips and we are out of here. I'm excited to move downtown. I really am. I'm also kind of nervous though because for one, I have no idea where we're supposed to park our car. Uh, another thing is that um, I'm not really sure that I'm going to enjoy having to walk up and down the, the mega flight of stairs that we have at the apartment. Because with our, oh god, with our original house, actually I can go this way, I'll go this way some more. With our, uh, with our old property we just left, we only had like three steps to get into that place. But with this one, there's like... I don't know, six, maybe... Oh, Jesus Christ, my! You're gonna run me off the road? There's like six, maybe seven flights of stairs that we have to climb. So that might kind of not be the greatest thing ever, but we'll, uh, we'll work with it. All right, I think we are coming up on the apartment complex now. Should be... Oh, no, 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 no. Should be right around the corner here to the right. Here we go. All right. I am, I guess, just gonna park on the sidewalk? That's safe, right? 
See, because where do I park? I, get, I could park over here next to the delivery van or even back behind the building if I really wanted to be a super good person about it, but I don't care that much. Do we have anything downstairs? I don't remember. We have trash cans in here and then bathroom or storage. This was a storage unit in the basement. So let's head all the way up to the very, very tippy top floor. I should have been counting these stairs, these stair sets. If you are counting them, let me know. I'm actually really curious on, on how many there are. Dude, look at this. Look at how much more space we got. Oh my God. Got the herringbone wood floors too. That's a nice look. This, uh, this texture right here is uh, looking very familiar. That's very house flipper. For sure, for sure. Man, this is nice. We got our own sink, got an oven, decent looking cabinets. Definitely not that easy on the eyes, but uh, it's something, you know what? It's something. We got a microwave, amazing view of downtown from here, from our kitchen. I feel so dirty, I have to take a shower. All right, don't freak out. We're gonna, we're gonna get to that. And then what I thought was just a tarp with some kanji on it is actually a shelving unit that uh, doesn't look like we can actually interact with that or move that in any way. So that's kind of weird. We have a column in this room and nothing else. Okay, and then we have a bathroom. Actually a decent sized bathroom. All right, I'm loving it. I am loving it. Yeah, dude, all the, the random rooms are really, really weird. I'm not really sure what the main purpose of this bedroom. Bedroom, for sure. Absolutely, freaking lootly that's a bedroom. I love the carpet, dude. Purple carpet? Can't beat that. He could, but that'd be weird. Living room. We got kitchen over here. Shelving unit. Bathroom. Maybe Bitcoin miner room. Maybe Bitcoin miner room. And then bedroom. I like it. I'm into it. Okay, let's start moving this stuff in. I've been uh, a little too distracted. A little too distracted. Oh, recording room, dude. We could have a separate recording room. That actually might be kind of nice. I'm going to combine both our bedroom and our recording room into one space. Maybe it'd be best if we have everything kind of in, in one confined area. Oh, we gotta eat too. We gotta go back to our uh, our old property and eat. Another bummer too is that we can't sell that property. It's just gonna sit there for ever and ever and ever. So that's that's kind of kind of great, I guess. Put our air conditioning unit right up there above the door, kind of like how we had it last time. Okay, bathtub right there, perfect, looking great. Place it down right there. Okay, we can use the toilet, which is good. We definitely need to do that. We can also use the bathtub. Dude, just running up that flight of stairs, I guess made us sweat so bad that uh, our hygiene went down real, real fast. And then the last thing we had in our inventory was our new bed that we bought in the last video. Also, if you guys watched the last video and you were like, wow, this is lame. Really the only like big thing that we did was buy this bed. And uh, I do apologize about that. But as I mentioned in that video, I was very, very busy that day. Thankfully, I, I have quite a bit more time today. So hopefully we get uh, quite a bit done here. Definitely pumped. Oh, did somebody move our car up against the sidewalk? We were parked like in the road. I bet you somebody drove by and just smashed into the side of us. Did they break my window? Oh, I hope they didn't break my window. I hope they didn't break into my car. Actually, I didn't, I don't know if people can do that, <laughs> but I hope that didn't happen. That would be no bueno. All right, I'm very hungry, I have to eat. I know, I know. We're gonna get, uh, Get the rest of this stuff moved in. One more trip to the car and we should have everything complete. But we have all of the computer components as well as the case. So we'll get that built up real quick and uh, just kind of put it on the floor somewhere. We'll put it in the bedroom, actually. All right, we'll get that put down, examine components, and we will get all of this assembled. Graphics card, the wham, the dedicated wham. Got our CPU and the motherboard. All right, perfect. PC is rebuilt, ready to rock. Let's go back down this mega flight of stairs. See, this is what I'm saying though. I don't know if I'm going to really enjoy, it's not so bad right now, but going up and down all these stairs could get pretty old pretty fast. So uh, we, uh, we might not be living here for very long. <laughs> all right, got every single other item. There's a lot of car accidents happening around us as well. Let's grab the, probably the desk first, because a lot of this other stuff is just kind of desk decoration. Let's get this put up right here. I think that's gonna work pretty well. And then this, put that there. 
All right, and the rest of the stuff is pretty straightforward. Kind of the same setup we had before. Actually, the exact same setup we had before. And lastly, we have our very crappy plastic chair that cannot be comfortable for hours at a time, but we do it anyways because it's all we got. And just like that, we are reassembled, ready to go, dude. I'm going to turn the computer on. We'll get it booted up. Get it running and then we're going to dip set back into the car we're going to head back to the old house and get the remaining bitcoin miners and then that's it we'll have to say sayonara to that place hopefully we never have to go back because honestly that neighborhood kind of freaks me out a little bit it's a little spooky oh no oh no we just ran out of gas oh that was dumb oh that was really dumb oh and brakes apparently too okay well um, that really sucks. We're definitely gonna need to bring our car with us to our new place. I remember seeing something in here. Add 25% of petrol or gas to your car. $89. I think we're we're just gonna have to do that. Is it it just does it automatically? Okay, cool. Alright, let's grab the remaining bit miners. Bit miners? <laughs> Bitcoin miners. Grab some food real quick. Eat the rest of our ramen that we ordered this morning. Okay, we will put all the rest of these things in our inventory. Goodbye, creepy, horrible home. I won't miss you. I will a little bit. I I'll miss your charm, but I'm not gonna miss living here. No, no siree. Okay, we do have fuel, that's good. That's good, we have enough to get around the corner and, uh, and hopefully fill up the rest of the way. Okay, gas station should be up here on the right. Slow down, slow down, slow down. <laughs> God, driving these cars is actually way harder than it looks, you guys. Way harder than it looks. Oh, I don't have enough money in my wallet. I don't have any money in my wallet, do I? We never do. We always we always put money back in our uh, on our card. So let's go get, um, I think it said like 200 bucks was max fill. So let's get about 200 bucks. We'll head back over there, fill it up. No sweat. God, I'm so ready to get out of this neighborhood, dude. So ready. It is, uh, it, it's about time. It really is. There we go. Max fill now, dude. We are good to go. And we're out. Never to be seen over in this neck of the woods again. We're gone. Okay, so our house still says it's there. You guys can kind of see that yellow waypoint off to our right. Still says it's over there, so hopefully... Maybe when we get over here or if we sleep in this place It'll it'll change. I, I I'm not sure how that works But I'm assuming that's how it's gonna go down. We'll have to sleep in the new property Before it'll uh, sort of reset our waypoints and stuff and here we are back downtown. I do think I'm getting a Whoo, sorry. I'm not trying to hit people. I think I'm getting a better handle on sort of where stuff is downtown, too. We, uh, we haven't really spent all that much time here, to be honest. There we go. We have done it. Got all of our Bitcoin. Oh, we can interact with this door? Nice, dude. Nice. Keep the riffraff out. Or is it rip raff? Rip rap. Home sweet home, dude. We have so much more room for activities in here, too. I, like, I don't even know what we would put in this building. I'm also really curious on where... Zamazor is going to deliver our packages because before they were delivered by our dumpster in our neighborhood and uh, I didn't see any dumpsters out front. Maybe they'll uh, sort of be dropped down by the delivery van. I don't know. Time will tell, but uh, things are looking good for us. Let's get our Bitcoin mining operation figured out. So we could put them in the living room for now. We could also put them in the kitchen because why the heck not? I think I want to give them their own space. And I feel like this room over here is going to work well for that. Let us start putting these things up so we can keep making that sweet, sweet Bitcoin. We should also check what Bitcoin prices are. Okay, I have to stop caring so much about the spacing in between all of these. I know it doesn't matter. It's not going to like overheat if they're too close or anything. But, uh, you know, OCD. It, uh, it's a thing. 1506. That's a seven. Oh, six. <laughs> if I remember correctly, is the minor code that we want to use. And then we can fire them all up and we will be making that sweet, sweet Bitcoin again, baby. There we go. Okay. And now, since we have our computer already set up over here, I really want to check on the Bitcoin prices as well as Dogecoin. 
because I'm just kind of curious on what it's doing now since we've already sold what we had before. So we'll go to the crypto website. 2,500 isn't terrible. Dogecoin actually went down, so we did sell at a good time. We sold technically in-game yesterday. We now have 0 0.782. Bitcoin. We almost have one entire Bitcoin, which is pretty awesome. That would equate to around $2,500. I'm pumped, dude. I'm freaking pumped to get just all of the Bitcoin. Actually, we have $1,700 right now. Why don't we go get at least one more miner just so we have a nice even number. And the nice part about that now too is that we don't have to drive to downtown because we now live in downtown, we can just run over and see the uh, the retired ex Jabawaki. Also, we got to stop at the ATM. ATM's pretty close to us. Can we? We can't can't hop the fence. All right. I'm not really sure what the maximum amount of miners that we can have is at the moment, but we've only we've only gotten up to this, and we already have five miners. So this would be our sixth miner. But it's supposed to prevent you from buying more not necessarily putting them up. So if it lets us buy this, we're good for at least six. There we go. All right, let's run this on back home. There's a nice little alleyway that we can cut through as well. But I guess we did have to use the ATM. It should let us install this with the others. I'm pretty sure, like I mentioned, it's supposed to prevent you from actually purchasing it in the first place. Yeah, there we go. All right, no sweat. No sweat at all. Get that put up right there. Let's change that miner code, 1506, and start miner. Absolutely beautiful. So we had around seven, I think it was 7.8 for our miner's power level, I guess you could call it. So now we're at 13.2, and that's not even including this PC. So that's pretty sick. And to wind down the day, I think it's probably in our best interest to uh, do a little gambling. Do a little, you know, a little scratchy scratch. Try to see if we can win big here. We need 5,000 again. I'm not even going to lie. We need 5,000. We've gotten two in the past. We've gotten one 1,000 now caught on camera, but we, we have yet to get that 5K caught on camera. That would have been a, a perfect ticket for it too. We literally lo we lost a ton of money right there. Like $300, $400. Yikes. Okay. Well, that kind of sucked. God, I'm just, I'm so happy to be out of that, uh, that old house, dude. This apartment is already so much better. And we, we like barely have anything. We have all of the same furnishing, the same equipment we had previously, but just having so much more space in here is, uh, is gonna be really, really nice. I can already tell. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am going to starve to death here, but I think that's where we're going to wind things down at for today once again if you guys did enjoy please leave a like leave a comment help support the dream by smashing that subscribe button and i will see you in the next one thanks so much for watching guys peace